This week I have two people messaged the Green Umbrella Facebook page and they've been asking about Facebook recommendations. The first thing they wanted to know is how to add the recommendation feature to your Facebook business page. And the second thing is how to actually write a Facebook recommendation on somebody else's page. So this is for you guys, your wish is my command. Okay, okay, like let's deal with the first one first. The first thing we're going to do is make sure that we've got that recommendation feature added out, uh, to your Facebook business page. So the first thing you need to do is be in as your business page. So we're going to click over on the cog on the right hand side and click down to your business. So obviously I'm going to go to the green umbrella page and let me just show you what I mean by the recommendation feature which is this. This is recommendations so people can actually write uh, recommendations I'm not sure if it should be called recommendations really because um, people can write like, bad stuff in there as well as good stuff so it should perhaps be called reviews or something like that anyway that's a whole other subject so next thing we need to do is make sure you click in on the about area okay and then edit over there on the right hand side now there's more than one way to get to this area but that's the quickest and easiest way I know this sounds a bit crazy but what you have to do is make sure that you've got your postcode added in uh, as long as that's on Google you're top notch there so put in your postcode and the next thing you need to do is to make sure you've got that little tick box ticked in there now I have no idea why but if you don't have that tick box in there then you don't get the recommendation feature so that's one thing you definitely definitely need to do so make sure you put postcode in make sure you've clicked that don't forget to come all the way down to the bottom and click save and then, hey you're done you have the recommendation feature that's the first one. Okay, the second thing is, how can you actually do a recommendation for another company? Um, so I'll go on to Sleephaven because he's one of the guys who asked me. So if we go on to Sleephaven's page. Now, one thing you can't do is recommend if you're in as a business. It's only people that can recommend the pages. Um, you can't recommend, a, um, so a business can't recommend another business. So Facebook, you need to sort that one out because it's not good. But anyway, so you do need to switch back if you want to recommend a page. Well, I'll go back to Julia Doherty. Then we'll go back to Sleephaven. Oops, there you go. What a lovely Facebook cover. I wonder who designed that. Anyway, let's come down. And then you can see um, I've got the recommendation feature here. And I can write an absolutely fan dabby dozy recommendation. What? Amazing service, top-notch guys. Okay, and I've had a good, great service from Richard, and I'm going to give him a five-star rating. And we're going to click. Oops, sorry. Click on there, and we're going to click recommend. The stars is only just a, a recent thing that's just happened, but you know, go for it. So that's it, me signing out for today. Hope that helps. That's the two features, how to add the recommendation feature to your business page and how to actually recommend other businesses. So um, I'll check it out for this week. I'll see you next week. Take care. Bye-bye.